Unit 11, Hobbies. Do you have any hobbies? Yes, I have several. Really? Please, tell me more about your hobbies. Well, I do like to collect things. Really? What do you like to collect? I like to collect stamps. Really? Where do you collect stamps from? I collect stamps from all over the world. Why do you do that? Because eventually I hope to have a stamp from every country. Why do you want all of those stamps? I think it's because I won't be able to go to those countries myself. Oh. What is another hobby of yours? I collect beer. Pardon me? You collect beer? Well, actually I collect beer cans. Okay. Where do you get the cans from? From every place that I travel to. Do you drink the beer? Nah, I'm not a beer drinker. Oh, I see. What about you? What are your hobbies? Well, I like to read a lot. Really? What do you read about? I like to read about bestsellers, and I like to read a lot about science, too. Hmm. What kind of science do you read about? A variety of topics, but I especially like to read about nature and about electronics. Fascinating. Why do you like to read so much? Well, I think it helps me exercise my brain. <laughs> well, that's a good reason, if it doesn't make you too tired. Do you have any hobbies? Yes, I have several. What do you like to collect? I like to collect stamps. What is another hobby of yours? Do you drink the beer? Nah. I'm not a beer drinker. What about you? What are your hobbies? Well, I like to read a lot. What do you read about? What kind of science do you read about? Unit 12, the first time to meet. Alex. Hey. Hey. This is my friend Bob. He's from England. Oh, hey. Um, excuse me, okay? Sit down, please. What city in England do you come from? I come from London. Have you ever been there? No, I've never been. I hope to go someday. You can, if you have true desire. Have you been here a long time? I've been here for about seven years. How about you? Oh, I've been here all my life. Why have you stayed here such a long time? I've stayed here for many reasons. Stayed for many reasons. Are you married? Yes, I am. Is your wife beautiful? Would you like to see a picture of my wife? That would be nice. Oh, she's very lovely. Is she from around here? Thank you. Yes, she is from here. Do you have any children? No, no children yet, but certainly in the future. Where do you work? I work at the newspaper. Wow, the newspaper. What do you do there? I'm a reporter. What city in England do you come from?
I come from London. Have you ever been there? No, I've never been. Have you been here a long time? I've been here for about seven years. Are you married? Do you have any children? Where do you work? I work at the newspaper. What do you do there? I am a reporter. Unit 13. What would you like to do? You actually get these kids to, to come onto the site. That's part of what's interesting. It's not a consumer model, if you will, but instead what we do is we go to the district. I'm bored. Let's do something. What do you want to do? I don't know. Anything is fine. Mm, let's go see a movie. No, I went to see three movies this week. Three? Whoa, why so many? Because I was bored all week. <laughs> well, you want to play some sports? No, I don't want to play any sports. Why not? Sports are fun. Well, I don't want to run around and get all hot. Yeah, it's kind of hot. Um, how about shopping? You want to go shopping? I like shopping, but I have to watch my money until the end of the month. Well, we can go eat dinner. Dinner is a good idea. Where would you like to eat? I heard about this new Japanese restaurant down at the mall. Huh. Is it expensive? Uh, it's not too expensive, but it's not cheap. Okay, well, that sounds good. And when we're finished, we can go window shopping. Hmm, that sounds like fun. Oh, and if we want, we can play some indoor air-conditioned sports. Really? Which sport has air conditioning? Bowling. Bowling. Right. Great. Let's go. Okay. What do you want to do? I don't know. Anything is fine. Where would you like to eat? I heard about this new Japanese restaurant down at the mall. Is it expensive? It's not too expensive, but it's not cheap. Which sport has air conditioning? Unit 14. Coffee or tea? Excuse me. Yes? Would you like some coffee or tea while you're waiting? Mm. Yes, that would be lovely. Thank you. Which would you prefer, coffee or tea? Mm. Uh, coffee, please. And how would you like your coffee? Mm. Two sugars and some milk. Okay, I'm sorry, but we don't have any milk. Is Coffee Mate all right? Coffee, Coffee Mate is fine. Okay. Just one coffee, I'll be right back. Oh, excuse me. Yes? Do you use fresh ground coffee? No, we don't. We use instant coffee. Nescafe, I think. Mm. I see. On um, second thought, can I have some tea, please? Yes. Tea. What kind of tea would you like? What kind of tea do you have? We have Earl Grey, green tea, or Lipton. Green tea is Chinese, is it not? Yes. I'll try the green tea. Okay. Would you like that iced or hot? Iced. Iced sounds nice. Okay. One, too sweet. One iced green tea. Would you like a cookie? Cookie? No, no thank you. Okay, how about an apple? Yes, I'd like an apple. Okay. One ice cream tea and one apple. I'll be right back. Mm. 
Would you like some coffee or tea while you're waiting? Yes, that would be lovely. Thank you. Which would you prefer, coffee or tea? And how would you like your coffee? Two sugars and some milk. Do you use fresh ground coffee? No, we don't. We use instant coffee. What kind of tea would you like? What kind of tea do you have? We have Earl Grey, green tea, or Lipton. Would you like a cookie? Unit 15. Have you ever traveled abroad? Have you ever traveled abroad? Yes, I have. In fact, I was born abroad. You were born abroad. Where were you born? I was born in Japan. You're joking. No, I'm not joking. It's true. I was made in Japan. <laughs> Do you speak Japanese? No, I don't. I left when I was young. How old were you? I was nine. You were nine years old and you do not speak Japanese? No, I was nine months old. Oh. What other countries have you been to? Well, I went to Mexico. How was that? It was great. What did you like the best? Well, the ruins were interesting. Anything else you liked? The beaches were nice. Where else have you been? I lived in London for one year. Really? How was that? Well, I was only eight years old. You were eight years old. What were you doing there? I went there with my mother. She was working there. Of all the countries you've been to, which is your favorite country? Thailand. Why do you like Thailand? I love Thailand because the food is delicious and the people are very friendly. Have you ever traveled abroad? Yes, I have. In fact, I was born abroad. Where were you born? I was born in Japan. Do you speak Japanese? No, I don't. I left when I was young. How old were you? I was nine. Where else have you been? I lived in London for one year. What were you doing there? Unit 16. Shopping. Hi. Can I help you? Yes. I'd like to buy a washing machine. Okay. Which brand would you like? I don't care so much about brands. So, what are you looking for? I'm looking for a good price and good function. Okay. Function and price are important to you. That's right. Okay. Uh, first, may I ask you, what size washer do you need? What do you mean by what size washer? Well, like, a small size is 4 kilos, a large size is 8 kilos. Do you have a medium size? Sure. Medium size is 6 kilos. Okay, I think I want a medium size. All right. And do you want a one-bin or a two-bin washer? What's the difference between one-bin and two-bin? Well, with a two-bin washer, you have to move the clothes to the spinner yourself. 
And the one bin? Oh, it does it automatically. It's a two in one spin bin. Oh, I understand. Um, which one cleans better? Uh, they clean the same. Really? And do the washers cost the same? Well, the one bin washer is more expensive, but it's simple to use. Uh, simple is important. Well, I think I'd like the one bin washer. Hmm. You know, if you like things simple and easy, may I suggest to you the fuzzy logic function? Mm, what is the fuzzy logic? Uh, fuzzy logic is a special function. It makes using the washer easier. Hmm, how does the function work? <laughs> well, you put in your clothes, you put in the soap, and the washer does the rest. Sounds perfect. This is exactly the kind of washing machine I've been looking for. Hi, can I help you? Yes, I'd like to buy a washing machine. Which brand would you like? I don't care so much about brands. So, what are you looking for? I'm looking for a good price and good function. What size washer do you need? Do you have a medium size? Do the washers cost the same? Well, the one bin washer is more expensive, but it's simple to use. How does the function work? Unit 17. My house was robbed. Hey. Did you have a good weekend? No. Not really. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. What happened? During the weekend, my house was robbed. Your house was robbed? What do you mean? I mean, I was not there, and someone came and took everything from my house. Someone took everything from your house? That's terrible. Terrible. Yes, I think so. Wow. Did they break anything? Yes, they broke a window to get in. Did they take your television? Yes, they took the television. Oh. Did they take the DVD player? Yes, they took the DVD player. Oh. Did they take your laptop? Yes, they took the laptop. Did they take your clothes? Yes, they... No, they did not take my clothes. Oh, <laughs> that's because your clothes are old and out of fashion. Do you really think my clothes are old-fashioned? Yes, I do. They're very old. Oh, this is terrible. First, my house gets robbed, and now my clothes are old-fashioned. Did you tell the police that your house was robbed? Yes, I told the police. What did they say? They didn't say much. They just took a report. Did you have a good weekend? No, not really. I'm sorry to hear that. What happened? During the weekend, my house was robbed. Did they break anything? Yes, 
They broke a window to get in. Did they take your television? Yes, they took the television. Did you tell the police that your house was robbed? Yes, I told the police. What did they say? They didn't say much. They just took a report. Unit 18. Asking information on the phone. Hello? Hi, is this Tina? Yes, it is. Who is this? This is Alex. Do you remember me? I'm sorry, I do not remember you. Um, did you come into the CS computer shop today? I went to many shops today. Where is yours? Our shop is located at the Galaxy Mall. Which floor is your shop on? Uh, CS computer is on the third floor. Oh yes, I think I remember now. What is your name again? My name is Alex Willis of CS Computer. Oh, I remember you now. You were the tall person. Very handsome? <laughs> yes, that's right. You have a good memory, Tina. So what can I do for you, Mr. Willis? Do you remember coming into our shop and asking about a catalog for computer games? Yes, I remember asking for the catalog. You could not find it. Right. I couldn't find it. But you have it now? Yes, I have the catalog. Great. Would you like for me to keep it here at the shop for you? No, I'm not free to go down there any time soon. Hmm. Well, since you cannot come to the shop, can I send you the catalog? That would be wonderful. Okay. May I have your address, please? It's 2307 T Street, Sacramento, California, 95610. Okay, was that 2703 T Street? No, that's 2307 T Street. Okay, I have your address, and I'll send it to you today. Great, thanks. My pleasure. Mr. Willis? Yes? I often have questions about computers and games. Oh. Well, you can ask me anything. It's my business. Thanks for that. May I have your phone number? Sure. It's 01-867-5309. Call me any time if you have a question. Thanks a lot. My pleasure. Goodbye. Bye-bye. This is Alex. Do you remember me? I'm sorry, I do not remember you. Where is yours? Our shop is located at the Galaxy Mall. What is your name again? So what can I do for you, Mr. Willis? Would you like for me to keep it here at the shop for you? No, I'm not free to go down there any time soon. May I have your address, please? May I have your phone number? Unit 19. Why do you have a headache? Honey, I'm home. How are you? I'm terrible. I have a headache. I'm so sad to hear that. What gives you a headache? There are so many reasons. Maybe you'll feel better if you tell me. 
Well, work is my biggest headache. What is wrong at work? It's my boss. He always scolds me. Why does your boss scold you? He says I'm lazy and I take too many breaks. Well, do you take too many breaks? I don't think so. Well, why don't you ignore your boss? I can't ignore him. He's my boss. That's too bad. What else gives you a headache? What else gives me a headache? My coworkers. My coworkers give me a headache. Why do your coworkers give you a headache? Because they're always gossiping. Do they gossip about you? Probably, but not to my face. That's too bad. What else gives you a headache? Driving. Driving gives me a headache. Why does driving give you a headache? Well, there's always traffic jams, and there's no place to park. Hmm. Why don't you take a bus to work? Take a bus to work? It's too crowded, and there's never a seat. That's too bad. What can you do to get rid of your headache? Easy. I come home and I see you. How are you? I'm terrible. I have a headache. What gives you the headache? There are so many reasons. What is wrong at work? It's my boss. He always scolds me. Well, why don't you ignore your boss? I can't ignore him. He's my boss. Why does driving give you a headache? There's always traffic jams and there's no place to park. What can you do to get rid of your headache? Easy. I come home and I see you. Unit 20. What should we get for the party? Are you excited to go to the party? Yes, I am very excited about the party. Do you think we should bring something with us? Yes, I think we should bring a gift or something. What would be good to bring? What about bringing flowers? But the flower shop is so far away. Can you think of something else? What if we bring some chips? Uh, someone else will be bringing chips. Can you think of something else? What about bringing food? Well, we don't have to bring food because there's going to be a buffet at the party. What about bringing my music CD collection? Bringing your music CD collection is a good idea. But they're going to have a DJ at the party. What about bringing some playing cards? You don't have to bring playing cards because there's going to be a mini casino at the party. Really? There's going to be a mini casino at the party? Really? It's true. I'm not kidding. Can you think of something else? There's only one thing the party does not have. What's that? The party does not have us. Let's just bring ourselves. Yeah! Are you excited to go to the party? Yes, I am very excited about the party. Do you think we should bring something with us? Yes, I think we should bring a gift or something. What would be good to bring? What about bringing flowers? 
but the flower shop is so far away. Can you think of something else? <laughs>